And we are live for our first Buffalo Sabres versus Toronto Maple Leafs game we have ever covered on the channel. This is the first time we are covering one of these games and it does not matter if the Leafs win or lose today. We are in the playoffs. This game is completely pointless to actually make anything. We, we've made it. So... Uh, we are here. We are going to be checking out and watching a decent game of hockey, though. Just because it doesn't matter does not mean it's going to be a, not going to be a Every good game. Every student in college is not going to be here. Oh, I never went to college. Oh, well, then you're not qualified for this job. Uh, hey, awesome day. Hey, Colito. Hey, Landon. Yeah, okay, I get it, Colito. Let's just try not repeat the behavior that we did yesterday. Thanking you. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, oh, I saw the uh, KFC one. That was very funny, Landon. Uh, and the Canadians one was funny as well. I will give you a plank for both of them. Congratulations. We are live on Cracked Screen Productions for yet another hockey game. Uh, as Tom had mentioned on his stream, it does not matter. The Leafs could lose this game horribly. And every game moving forward, they have clenched the playoff spot, so they, it doesn't really matter whether they win hey, or Kevin. lose. But we'd like them to win. We, we definitely we definitely want them to win. But, uh, guys, let's get this stream rolling. Exactly, Landon. Uh, hey, Mike, it's, it's it's okay that you missed both streams. Um, I'm, I'm doing all right. How are you doing today, mate? Uh, Dave, you have to put Leafs in my chat because someone said, let's go, Leafs. Oh, sorry, they said go, Leafs, go. Sorry. Yeah, give me a second. I'm still trying to zoom in chat so I can actually fucking read what's on the screen. Yeah, my eyes are deteriorating fast. Oh, oh maybe they did, Awesome Jay. I don't, I don't know. They must have then if you can't find Thank it. You. Thank you. Uh, bulletproof vest will be stabproof vests. Uh, what's going on, David? How you doing, so my I'll dude? I'll take the bulletproof vest. Hey, David. <laughs> yeah, all um, bulletproof. You a couple comments actually on a on a video that I didn't reply to because I I wanted to do it in person. Uh, let me just quickly. Uh, let's see, what were they? Um, is the heart an organ or a muscle? It is both. Um, uh, just to give you, uh, uh, the answer to that, Let's go, Lucia. and, uh, on, crime is about, uh, about as bad as it is anywhere else. Fair enough, KK, fair enough. I, they did seem unscripted. Oh, J-Rose just dropped another new video, and, uh, it's, uh, I don't know, man. Is it possible to beat the Elite Four with only level 5 Pokemon? That's a really good video, and you need to watch it after this stream. Uh, uh, I, I, I've seen I've seen fucking uh, like Pokemon Black and White and Emerald and shit done with no XP gain. Yeah, yeah but you're not using level 5 Pokemon. Level because backwards you backwards even. Like, I've seen... Like, no, no, no! Still... Like you start at your your starter will never be anything higher than five. Yeah, but you're and catching it Pokemon. Up, it goes down to four. You're catching Pokemon, Pokemon that, that are going to be higher than level five. It takes less experience points. Yeah, but he, they catch Pokemon the higher level than level five in them runs. In this one, he doesn't. Uh, the only I, Pokemon I, he uses. I think the level. answer to that's pretty freaking obvious, uh, David. Just, just, just saying. You know, a safe person is obviously going to be the guy who takes it safe, and the daredevil is the guy who takes risks. Hey, Luke, how you doing, man? Taxes fucking suck. They are necessary evil, unfortunately. Oh, 
Oh, okay, okay, okay. That's going to be pretty good. Uh, game prediction. Uh, I'm going uh, four three Leafs with, uh, but they go into overtime. So three three going into overtime. <laughs> I don't think he is, Landon. I don't know That's... what I'm doing for dinner tonight. I gotta fend for myself. The wife is at my at her mom's. Uh, she had a like an eye appointment that meant she couldn't drive for a good long while after the appointment, so she's spending the night with her mom. She doesn't... Which, which means that I gotta find a fend for myself. Fair enough. Oh, I I love how KK's posting all kinds of shit in your chat, but yet he's a moderator for mine. He has said more in your chat than he has in mine. Oh, oh, keep that You're jealousy to yourself, tired, Dave. KK. You've got what? London. Oh no, I, sorry, I've got London. You've got Landon. What do you mean <laughs> you've got? I've got Landon. Landon still said more in your chat than than fucking he has in mine. Aww. It's official. Tom's stealing my viewers now. He just stole KK from me. So you've got London? You've got David? Or Cash App. I'm not at Uh No, Luke, I'm not. I don't need any more moderators, dude. You, you know, you know what my what my scream answer to that would be. Uh, row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. I tip the thing, and then, or something, something about like tipping it, and then you got to, and that you let out a scream. Hey, Sammy. Okay, that's interesting that, KK. Oh, no, Drew McIntyre is definitely not up to par with Roman. Drew McIntyre got really fucking stale very quickly. post quick. the conversation you're having with Tom currently in my chat, and I'd talk to you about wrestling. Am I not allowed friends, Dave? Hey RJ, you see you have RJ! What's going I on? I don't get here? RJ! Yeah, but KK's mine. My real friend. My moderator. You fired yeah, and you him. Have, you have my moderator you in told, there. You, matter of fact, and you told him there. you didn't want him even in VC anymore. And you go, okay, we can have KK every time I ask if we can add him. So you know what? KK, you should be in my chat because I'm loyal to you. I like you and I want you around where Tom doesn't. I said I didn't want to win the chat. You stole my moderator. Wait, no, no, I didn't. Landon only became a moderator like two days ago. Get over your fucking self. <laughs> He's still a moderator on my channel. <laughs> oh, okay. Who's, uh, they're still playing yeah, New York Yankees. Right. Hello, Arsenal. Cool. Did you know that your pop bot, your two liter pop bottle, starts off no bigger than a fucking test tube, and then goes, and they make a bottle out of it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm surprised they beat the Yankees. That's a very good win that when uh, they beat the Yankees. I, I don't know yes. who the world's strongest okay. man is, but it's definitely not yet. It's it's definitely not Mark Henry anymore. Uh, probably not going to happen, Sammy. What's Hello, that? Anthony. Welcome. How you doing, man? Uh, yes, I did. I'm going to have to look at me potentially going, but I probably won't be able to afford it because it's probably going to be massively expensive tickets. Wait, spaghetti's here? That's wicked. I want to go to that restaurant. Uh, um, I'm not <laughs> I'm glad you're here, Landon. I'm glad yeah, you're here. Hi, Ronnie Hood. Okay, okay. 
I told him that he was getting, uh, what is it, SummerSlam this year? I love this. He's Why is it in September? September? Why is it in September, though? I don't know. No, it does. No, no, no. I, that, that works, obviously. Fucking pops are enough. Wait, no. But what event are we getting? September 3rd. Hey, Jesse. So, uh, yeah, um, I'm trying to figure out in that uh, that create your own Pokemon game, uh, I'm trying to figure out how to make um, mom go, hey, honey, or, or hey, the professor's looking for you. By the way, here's your Poke gear. Before yes, you are, it gives me Poke gear. Oh, here's your Poke gear, by the way. Mom, yeah. I know. Oh, well, Kevin. Yeah, You'll but it, never what, get... I want to, want her to, what I want it to do is trigger the text first, saying the professor's looking for you. By the way, here's your... Uh, your uh, I could probably do it. It's just I got to rearrange. Hi, morning. Dave, you had a question in my chat. Sucks, Ronnie. Uh, uh, because the last uh, time England got a goddamn pay per view wrong. was in like two thousand and two. So I'm sorry, but you can shove your three years for a pay per view up your ass because we didn't get one until like, the last proper one we got when, when it was SummerSlam '95. So we're allowed one. You get freaking everything, being mm, Canadian. Well, at least that's what they want you to think. <laughs> right? Hey, David. <laughs> no, not going in there. Boston is many miles away, Anthony. It's quite a trek to drive. <laughs> Most people uh, would fly to it. WWE does not hate Canada. SummerSlams, are, we, we get oh, SummerSlams. Oh, was it Wembley 92 was when the SummerSlam was. I couldn't remember the year the SummerSlam was. Wrestling Network, off the top of my head. That's fucking beautiful. Yeah, I, I, I saw your message, honey. Yeah, what's the event, KK? Because people are telling me that apparently SummerSlam is in Canada. What event are we getting then? Because yeah, they cut a piece off of it and it like shines through and it looks really cool. That's cool. To find a clear quartz like that. SummerSlam is in Nashville. Then what event are we getting on September the third? If you have to pick up something heavy, don't ask for any help. Pull out your backhoe. Be a man. Tell that to my back that's already blown out. Okay. Oh, it won't be a house show, it's a pay-per-view. It's actually a pay-per-view because it's going to be as big as Wembley in 92, apparently. So, it's not just going to be a house show. I mean... The annoying thing is, I now need to book the pissing day off work unless they pre-tape it. Which they might fucking do, because they always do for England. It isn't a major pay-per-view. I mean, God forbid we can actually have it live for once. Because every time we do Raw and SmackDown in England, you have to pre-tape it and put it on later.
Yeah. Did. He did land in. That was the first and only time the WWE title was won outside of North America and Canada. Uh, it was SummerSlam 92, Ronnie. Not SummerSlam 93, dude. It was SummerSlam 92. Not 93. Ooh, that'd be cool, London. We, we are not uh, okay sorry uh, let's uh, yeah I got your message honey um, Harry favorite Harry Potter movie is Goblet of Fire because of the dragon and literally only because of the dragon I am not related to Tom he lives in England I am Canadian um, and no we're not the guy next to me is not related to me either Hey, look at look at this! Look at this! You can tell it's the end of the season. Owen Power making his NHL debut tonight for Buffalo. Ooh, we haven't got anyone making their debut now. I guess because we're in the playoffs. But a set, I'm assuming a Sabers in? Question mark. <laughs> and as far as short haired girls go, and the girls that he was with in the show, she was the finest one out of. Oh no, the Sabers are definitely not fucking in. Sabres are one hundred percent not in. Sabres were definitely eliminated weeks ago. Uh, yeah, KK. Uh, there you go, mate. Come on, dude. Yeah, I've you seen can't them remember to Google NHL sixty six. Uh, it was. Uh, that was a uh, fun fact. Um, British Bulldog did not and remember anything about. The link. He asked you for the uh, link when I'm the guy who, who gave you the link. No, I'm not dating my roommate. I I have a wife. She's not here tonight. You were way too ugly for me to ever date you. I'm sorry. Uh, who won what? I got. Actually, if you're talking about the hockey, the hockey hasn't even begun yet, mate. Uh, no, he beat Br British Bulldog. Beat Bret Hart in England for the IC oh, title shit. in 1992, Ronnie. It was one of the biggest moments in British Bulldog and UK Wait, history. It was 92, mate. Uh, at that point, I'm going. Nate, Nate. Uh, my name's not Nate, but okay. I, I, I really enjoy I think that that's a typo, Tom, because M is right next to M on the... Uh, oh, that is true. Yeah. On the, on the keyboard. Uh... Uh, basically, what happened is British Bulldog took so much cocaine before, like, three days before the match, he does not remember... Well, he remembers the match, but he does not remember... Uh, he did not remember any of the spots going into the match. Bret Hart had to call the entire match to British Bulldog uh, spot by spot for the entire match because British Bulldog forgot everything because of how much cocaine he did. He legit oh, did not know any of spots of the match. That's a lot of dog. Because yeah. he, he took that much cocaine. Uh, thoughts on go-karts? Go-karts are cool. Um, yeah, that's right, too. The NBA playoffs are going to be starting soon. Uh, yeah, he is. I mean, don't get me wrong. I think Bret Hart is a miserable oh, cunt is. now, but hey-ho. Well, I mean, think think about it this way: you're you're one fucking head injury away from how stroking out to the point that you're fucking dead. I'd be pretty miserable that there's nothing I can do in the industry that I loved being in, as well. Uh, I I personally think that that is why ninety like any any you get any um any old person who is grumpy as shit. 
I guarantee you they did something cool in their lives and they can't, they're not able to fucking do any of it anymore. And that's why they're miserable. Fair enough. I know this being well, you think about it. If you were a fucking war general calling calling all the shots and you were the guy, you know, marching soldiers where they needed to be, and now you're in a nursing home where somebody has to wipe your fucking ass for you, I'd be pretty fucking miserable to most people around me too, right? True. Sure. And, uh, guys, the game is underway. We got uh, Toronto taking on Buffalo. Uh, the, we've got our first whistle of not the true, game. Not, not being correct there, Johnny. Um, is, uh, are the Kraken playing tonight, Tom, or no? Uh, yes, they are playing at 9 p.m. I believe okay, they are so playing that Detroit. That game will start just before this one ends, then. Yeah, I might watch that casually, but I'm no way in hell watching it on live stream. Oh, no, we're playing the Flames. Okay, Ace, but, can you can you like enough with your questions? No, I'm not into men. I have a wife. I I, I like men in the capacity of friendship. Like clearly, I have a, a male friend, but like as far as relationships with men go, like on a on a sexualized level, no. And David, I'm gonna tell you again. I don't give a fuck who you block or why. Keep that shit to yourself. That that is between you and your your fucking internet history. Oh shit, the Leafs are already on the penalty kill. They're not even a minute in the game yet. They've already <sighs> fucked up enough to give them the to give Buffalo the power play. Jesus. Let's go uh, box, then cat. Uh, let's go box. Bruins. Yeah, I'll, I'll be sure to be there for you when we crush Boston this year. Yeah. yeah. What? I have no idea who the hell they are. Uh, Landon, I don't know anything about NBA. Yeah, I'm trying to answer people's questions to the best of my ability. I'm just, you know, wondering why he's asking who I'm in a relationship and who I'm with and who I'm sleeping with and who I'm dating. Like, you know, you can go and go and check out like 99.99% of my streams and there's a beautiful woman sitting beside me who identifies as my wife, so... What call you? Oh, hey Kevin, I'm good. How are you doing, man? Who has a crush on me? No, I'm pretty sure the only person who has a crush on me here is Awesome Jay. <laughs> yeah, most people do, but you know, I think Ace Enchanted was in your chat last night or the night before, wasn't it? Yeah, he got banned. It was um, last night. They got banned for being an arsehole. You know where uh, after that person got banned for trying to call shit about race, then he came in and said the same thing, so he got banned. Okay. You, you're the one who banned him. Oh, yeah. Uh, thoughts on soap operas? I used to watch Days of Our Lives with my mom. Like, she would actually... That's a, that's a real show. I thought that was just made up for the purpose of Friends. No, Days of Our Lives is actually a real show. Fair enough. Um, uh, but no, uh, I used to watch Days of Our Lives with my mom. Um, she'd let me skip the occasional like. Ba basically, if you had like, th if I had four period or three periods in the afternoon of school, uh, I was making it for the last two because I'd say my she'd give me the extra long lunch so I could watch Days of Our Lives with her, and then I'd go to school. But that was only on occasion. She she didn't like letting me skip school. But I was like, come on, I want to watch it. Yeah. Nice no, save by uh, Colgan then. Uh, if I had to pick an NBA team, I'd probably go with the Raptors, just because they're a Toronto team and they're they're close close by, right? Okay. Yeah. There you go, Landon. We're cheering for the Raptors. Boo, Kev's team.
think unless you're a really smart parent or you are willing to go and like hire a teacher to teach your kids at home, homeschooling is a is a great way to bring up idiot children. Mm. I'm good, Resident Evil. How are you doing, man? What's going on, Charlotte uh, Flair? Woo! How you doing? Leafs are god tier. That's all I have to say. I don't bow down to anybody. Hell, I I don't even get down on my knees to pray. Um, no watch. Awesome, Jay. Uh, there there's really no kinda about it, Kev. They they're they're from Canada. They're the only Canadian NBA team that that is remaining. Fair enough, awesome, Jay. Uh, the Memphis Grizzlies used to be the Vancouver Grizzlies, and then they got shipped off to Memphis. And uh, so we used to have two uh, two teams, one for the East and one for the West, but uh, we only have the one Canadian team now. Uh, that's why their their whole thing is we the North, because they represent Canada. They represent the North, like the northmost part of America, within the the National Basketball League. Fair enough. Okay. Or, uh, Took you about uh, five minutes to respond to that comment, now. I love grilled cheese. Especially if I have like a tomato or a cream of mushroom soup to, to dip it in. Uh, what's most a uh, most annoying Pokemon? Um, Shininja when you can't early fucking get past it. Is hey hey Tom? Shininja uh, when you can't get past it. Early on in the in a in a Nuzlocke hardcore nuzlocke because that thing only knows explosion like <laughs> you're getting because basically uh, you, you, you sack an encounter uh but what was your How most annoying pokemon uh, my most annoying pokemon your ninja if you ever call it early that thing was a bitch yeah but they've they've made it it since that you can't the, the shininja is more of a late game mon now yeah fair enough uh, but the most annoying Pokemon I would probably oh. have to say is uh, Lorelei's Dugong in general. How? Oh yeah, about to say how would that not be a holding penalty? Hey, hey Tom, uh, yeah. did you know that in Gen One, is specifically Red and Blue, that Lorelei can just basically like soft lock you on her Dugong? Yes. yes. That if you if you can't uh, basically if you can't kill it after it uses rest, reset the game and go level up some more. Yeah. Because uh, it'll did just, you know? It'll, it'll, what what'll in happen yellow, is, um... is you'll use two attacks against it, and it'll uh, it'll use rest right to, to heal itself. If you can't beat it in three turns, you reset and keep leveling. Because uh, no, you, no, it's not, not Johnny. Gonna, I, I'm not bowing to the queen. I don't bow to anybody don't, or anything for that matter. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm a big fan of Yu-Gi-Oh. Never really got into Digimon. Oh, I, I I enjoyed the first. Like I've watched every series of Digimon pretty well, and the one that I liked the most was uh, either the original series. Was close. Uh, the original series with running. Ty and 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 all those guys. Uh, like Greymon and Agumon and uh, Gabumon and Tentamon. Like, it was just a really well written series. Um, but uh, the one that was probably my favorite was, I think it was season three or series three, where it was, uh, I think it was called Digimon Tamers, and they had um, uh, the Digivices that they would, like, swipe their cards through. And I, I thought that was a really fucking cool concept to bring the cards into the Digimon show. Um, but, uh, yeah, that was probably my favorite Digimon series. Uh, Johnny, uh, you're being sarcastic right now, because, uh, Pokemon is the biggest entertainment franchise of all time. That's in terms of merchandise, selling, and shit like that. Pretty sure it's like one of the, I'm pretty sure it's the biggest selling entertainment franchise of all time. It's everywhere. Fair enough, Johnny. Hi, Jess. Beyblades is wicked. Uh, anime was a bit... Mm. Pac-Man's okay. 
Pac-Man's okay. Beyblades were cool back in the day when they when they were very simple and you, it was more like more like battling tops. But now they got this burst thing. They've got these ones with the trigger where you can re-rev them while they're spinning in your dish. Uh, like they they just overcomplicated it for no fucking reason at all. And I just I'm I, I appreciated it when it was simpler. No, I don't think Mario is, dude, because Mario sells nowhere near the amount of merchandise. Uh, Mario is what, uh, Kev? I'm, I'm not your biggest fan. I'm gonna, I, I'm gonna be honest with you, Charlotte. I'm, I'm not your biggest fan. I think you're over pushed and over hyped and. Nobody really wants to see you on screen anymore because you've been on screen so much for the last, like, two and a half, three years. I'm surprised you don't have the, one of the, the biggest records for uh, uh, longest reign yeah. champions of all time. As of 2021, uh, Pokemon's the biggest, uh, second biggest selling games franchise, but that's not counting the merchandise as in cards, toys... Plushies, t-shirts, t-shirts. all of that Clothing combined, general, Kev, really. makes Pokemon the biggest selling franchise of all time. Like, I'm talking including all merchandise, it smashes fucking everything. The only thing that's ever made more money than it is GTA V. Because that makes fucking shit tons. You gotta be careful. Uh, wait, what Pidgeot are you talking uh, about, Anthony? Because you can't catch a wild Pidgeot in Generation 1. You can catch a wild Pidgeotto in the forest in yellow, but you cannot catch a wild Pidgeot. So that must have uh, been a glitch. Yeah, uh, you can catch a wild. I can catch a wild whatever the fuck I want using the Mew glitch. Yeah, I'm, I'm talking about legitimate means. I don't think you set the Mew glitch up to catch a Pidgeot. Because yeah, that would uh, require a very no, specific set. There's nowhere to set. catch Pidgeot. You, you, have to, you can catch Pidgeotto in some versions, I think, but you can't catch Pidgeot. Uh, Pidgeotto in yellow is in the forest. And uh, yeah, it's level 9. That was I'm a not, not uh, I'm also pretty sure that um, you can... You can get it uh, in some regions in uh, red and blue as well, like closer to Erica, maybe. Uh, yeah, Pidgeot is catchable in that, but I'm talking about with well, quote unquote, not level Pidgeot. That Pidgeot is that they're meant to be Pidgeotos. This one's the only way you can catch it where it's under leveled, because you know, yellow is wicked. Uh, 15 yes, cards are. for 30 bucks? That's nothing, man. I went and I bought a booster box, okay? I bought a, I bought a booster box. From that booster box, I was able to get enough cards that I, when I sold them back to the store, that I was able to fund another opening, bo uh, another opening video. Yeah. Like, it wasn't a booster box. I, I got a bunch of the, like, there were 10 Pokeballs with, like, three boosters inside. And a coin and whatever, but you get to keep the the novelty Pokeball. And, well, you uh, got my opinion, Charlotte. So deal with it. As half of this stream, I am. Uh, God uh, fucking Buffalo damn it! Takes the lead on the power play. One nothing, damn, Buffalo. Damn it. With uh, twelve thirty-five left in the first period, too. Frog splash good. beyond. A frog splash would be my finisher. Uh, frog splash is generally done by skinny people beyond. So fuck you. Yeah, that would make you a very bad mod then, David, because you'd ban people for irrelevant things. Moderation ha moderators have to use their logic and not just... 
Yeah, and, um, that that was one thing I was saying, uh, gonna say yesterday. I meant to mention it yesterday. Is there was one band I don't disagree with the band because well they they could have escalated, but like it was a little preemptive on Ellie's part. The first one that she did. In my personal had, opinion, just saying. Yeah, if I remember that situation, it was maybe. Um, I'm not saying you're easily despised. I'm just saying people don't like you right now, because they they and this is myself included. Uh, feel like your opportunity to shine has far exceeded uh, the opportunity of any other star within the within the WWE, and uh, therefore I feel that you have taken opportunities from uh, from other talent. Like, I, I don't see why anybody needs to be a 13, 14 time champion. Especially when you're when you're you're, you're letting people go. Prime rib's good. Uh, we, let's not talk about food. I haven't made dinner yet. I gotta make something during first intermission. Why are you putting that in front of the net? Paul, you're a fucking dumbass. I fucking hate Hall. He is by far our worst defender. Yeah. Uh I I think that that's what that's what's happening, Johnny Blaze, is that they don't have to win any of their games moving forward, so I think we're all a little bit insecure because the the societal views of what we should be far exceed that which Ooh, most of us can actually attain. To put that very simply, what we're supposed what what we're told we're supposed to be is is vastly out uh, vastly unattainable. No, Halo's absolutely nowhere near Anthony. Yeah, but that was a different time. That was that was that was a very different time. You got a lot of talent now. You know, let, 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 let's see Matt Riddle be champion even for a little bit. I mean, let, let, let's let him design a new championship too. Fuck, John Cena got to make one and he made a doofy ass fucking uh, spinner belt, right? So uh, you know, let, let's. Uh, let, let's uh, let uh, Riddle change the W into like a pot leaf or something like that, or one of the mushrooms from his fucking tattoos. Yeah, very, very. Smart. Uh, Halo has sold well, eighty-one well, well, million well, units well, of well, games. That's nowhere near pro competition. I, I will give you that. Um, I mean, I feel like you use kind of face moves as a as a heel like like your your top rope springboard diving bullshit like that that's a face move yeah. uh I feel hey, like halo is gonna more... pokemon you, you, is you, never you, gonna you, be uh, Char charlotte flair you want to know what i want from charlotte flair i want her to go in and just fucking dominate people like if that's if they if they're gonna make her champion like that stop this talking and whatever and just have her come in and like beat the fuck out of people and and slam the shit out of them she talks her way to too Amazon. fucking much. You know, and then it looks even better when, when you know, you have somebody who who's who beats her. Right now, you're you're boring. You come out, you talk about this, that, and the other thing, and, and you don't really do much hey. on the show. Like, we don't ever see you wrestle unless it's a pay-per-view. Oh, that 
was close. close. That was close for Matthews right there. That's very close. Oh, tucked in front. You still couldn't get that. But um, as for attractive, I, I'm getting to the second half of that. Um, there are nights where the camera is not very nice to you, and then there are other nights where you look fantastic on camera. You range from math to ugly. There, there was uh, what a few a few weeks ago she came out and I and 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 I was like, I, I didn't say anything because you know we we generally have like a, a taboo on finding Charlotte fit, right? Like that's just taboo. But uh, there there was a there was another night where she came out in like a really long oh, elegant you, dress and it was she just she looked proper and I, fuck I, I, you know she has her moments but most most days it's meth or worse. It. Hell no, that Roman Reigns fair Cody. Who, who's in that? Uh, uh, Shogun. 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 All right. Well, that explains why we're down by one. He's gonna at least let in one. Hmm. Ah, yes. Called the backwards. Uh, definitely not. But uh, I kind I of agree with what KK said in. Uh, in, in Tom's chat, uh, Cody's going to end up taking one of the belts from Roman. It, it's unfortunate, but that's just how it's going to end up being. Yeah, and then Cody will drop it and go back to the mid-card where he belongs for the rest of his career. Yeah, well, let that be what it is. I know, Kev. You still shouldn't fuck with snakes, but at least you pick hey, one that hey, wasn't hey, poisonous. Tom, I, I also had a question for you. The uh, the program that I use to I'm using to uh, to build the Pokemon game that I'm working on right slowly yeah. guys this is gonna be a very long time in the making but um, it says it has to run in uh, hold on I gotta uh, ten twenty four by seven sixty eight or bigger yeah. Is 1280 by 720, which is 720p, is that not bigger? Um, you say 1024 by... Uh, I don't think it is. Because it doesn't, it doesn't even use the full amount of my widescreen screen. Like, it, it literally, like, makes it like an old-school screen. Try and see if you can put it in uh, 720p. If not, try and get it in 1080. And that should fill your entire screen. 1080 would definitely be bigger, yeah? No, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm going to, to try something then. Let's minimize that. Let's go display settings. My middle display, and let's go 1080. Yeah. I don't really have any, Anthony. It's been a very long yeah, time since I casually played Pokemon. Because fuck, I can't even read that. Yeah, exactly, David. So it's called the American. Well, oh, to be fair, oh, his gimmick's been the American better. Nightmare for ages. Yeah, it loads in 1080. That's way better. I mean, the. But yeah. Uh, it's only delayed oh. by a second or two, KK. So, so only because guys, you know latency. I want to show shit. you something. I need any of my streaming software. No, oh, taskbar is only out right here. Um, so so I'm using uh, it's called RPG Maker XP, and I've downloaded uh, I guess it's like a patch or something. I I, I can't remember what it actually was, but uh, so I'm I'm creating a Pokemon game. Uh, if you look here, I've created the uh, like the the starting your starting room and then the downstairs portion. Um, yeah. I've also got the uh, the actual starting town. 
Uh, I have to change out the water because you can walk on it right now, and you're and you're not supposed to. So I gotta I gotta fix that. But uh, I've got starting town, so you can actually right now, if I was to play this, you can actually start in this room. Um, if you click on the uh, press A or whatever on the game console, it uh, it says you played a game within a game. Mind blown, right? You can nice. interact with the bookshelves already. Um, come yeah, in here, you'll today. automatically come down here. Uh, I haven't figured out mom yet. Uh, the, it's it's not doing what I want to do in the order that I want it to do it. Um, and yeah. then the other thing is you can come out the door to here. It, mm. like, and you'd be you'd be right here. Now what? here here's the question that I have for you guys. Um, do you want to watch me build this? Like it's it's gonna be it's definitely gonna be uh, a lot of a lot of trial and error and uh, you know just generally effing around with the with the uh, with, with the program, right? Because I'd be learning it kind of as I'm doing it. But is that something you guys would be interested in watching? Like me build the Pokemon game from scratch? I'd like to see it. Uh, and to answer your question, David, no. The American Nightmare name comes from New Japan, not AEW. He used it before going to AEW. He's been the American Nightmare pretty much since he left WWE and left Stardust as a character. You don't have a physically big head. They're talking about e your egotistical head. Give me I one second. Uh, I yeah, have they're not talking about metaphors. Jesse, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, there, okay, I read that. The American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. He can't be called the American Dream. That was his dad. And he can't be called the Natural. That's his brother. So it makes sense that he'd be the American Nightmare. And he'd be the, you know, the guy who goes and signs with the company that he spent two years dissing because they pay him more. Hello, Ellie. Um, so he's been the American like Nightmare, nightmare since he left WWE. Uh, uh, That's be he was a heel, so he became the American Nightmare to be the heel um, version of the yeah, American Dream. You, you kind of... I mean, not a physically big head, but like when it comes to being egotistical, yeah, you you think you're you're fucking God's gift to creation. Uh, no, I didn't eat Jesse. It is Landon, yes. He did it in um, he did it in New Japan um, and uh, Ring of Honor because he was a heel. He became the American Nightmare because he was the heel version of the American Dream. That's where the name came from. He was he was the heel version. So he he just used um, American Nightmare to be a heel version of the American Dream. No, we don't plan to bow down to you. But uh, by the way, guys, is that is that something you'd like to see? Is uh, you know my process of working through creating a Pokemon game? Wait, Gilbert Godfrey died. Wait, wait, wait like Gilbert? As in like the the the, the... The, the the guy who played literally the, the, the smaller Goldberg on WWE? No, no. Gilbert Godfrey is an actor. Oh, okay. I didn't know that Gilbert Godfrey died. Wait, what? What are you saying hell no to, Jesse? Hey, Jesse. Um, you are God's creation, Yes. Because you were, we, we were all created in. No, uh, we in died. Likeness. I started in Aladdin, apparently. Oh, Dave. And, uh, uh, he know, was in Aladdin, so you're known from uh, that. Down to you. I don't think. Uh, I don't think people want to watch me build a Pokemon game, Tom. I do. Yeah, but if you're the only guy, that's. I mean. Uh, Dave, you remember uh, Lago, the parrot, uh, Jafar's parrot in Aladdin? That was him. 
Yago, he voiced yes. that character. He voiced that character. Oh no! No, not yeah. that guy. That, that guy's that got guy. such a fucking iconic voice. Like, there goes a very iconic voice. Yeah, he uh, died, unfortunately. Long illness. Okay. That's very sad to hear. I haven't been on the internet, Landon. Ellie hasn't seen Aladdin. We must change this, Ellie. Yeah, Aladdin's probably my favorite Disney movie of all time. Mind you, Encanto is it's it's up there now. Like I, I can't help but fucking absolutely. We don't talk about Bruno. Movie. No, no, no. You're not allowed to sing that song, Tom, because you you haven't watched the movie, and you don't know why. Good, I don't want it stuck in my head. <laughs> no, no, you should not, Ellie. Watch the original. Um, Do not watch the remake. Hugs, as long as they're not in my house and they're not on or around me. If they come on to come on or around me, they get squished. Okay, Ali. No, she was saying that the you, she was saying hell no to your comment, Charlotte Flair. She wasn't uh, addressing you. Talking about you, not to you. And and I'm not trying to be cheeky either. It's it's li literally the truth. Dave, you need to put me in the Pokemon game. I'd say that it, it kind of tops out at uh, like Gen four or five graphics, if I'm honest. Like if you if you. Oh, sorry, Miz. Uh. Um, you're not my queen. I have a queen. She's called Queen Elizabeth. And she's a far, far better queen than you will ever be. Yeah. Here, here, yeah I have one queen. Thing. What are you queen of? You have no subjects. And you're not even queen of the ring because that's currently Selena Vega who's actually the queen of WWE. So you're yeah, not so even the queen of WWE. Queen? I have it. And, and here's the other thing. Didn't nope. Selena win the first Queen of the Ring ever? Yeah, so she's officially the only how Queen of WWE. You... Yeah, but how? You're, you're, you're not even close to being the face of WWE. That's been John, The Rock, John, uh, Stone no. Cold, then The Rock, then John Cena, then uh, now it's Roman Reigns' turn. It was Seth Rollins. And if you're talking about really women done. face of the company, Trish Stratus... Becky Lynch has been more of a face of the WWE than you have. I'd agree with that. Uh, yes, it does. That's literally the point of the tournament is to crown the queen. Yeah, like they even uh, they they even changed her name to Queen Zelina. Yeah, man, I got you, no problem. Um, Done. Tom, if you can get there to you that go, before me, because I don't actually have NHL sixty six open right now. I got it for you. All right, awesome. Thank you. I'm uh, I'm copying the link now. I just, I can't have it open because it literally bogs everything down. Bye, David. All right, see you later, David. Yeah, and Charlotte, you just declaring yourself the queen makes you even less of a queen. Um, no, no you thank literally... Thank you very much, Sam, and no problem. Um, if you're a wrestling fan too, by the way, we uh, we also have links for uh, WWE. How? How AEW. are you, Charlotte? You just declared that you are the queen. You have less yeah, right yeah, to be yeah, queen yeah, yeah, yeah. than someone who won the tournament. It's okay. It's okay. She's a queen. She's a queen. You know how she's a queen? How? She's a goddamn drama queen. Every time she Ooh. gets in, her, in the ring, where, 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 drama, drama, drama. I, I, I have to do this and I have to do that. I should just have the title and nobody should ever challenge me because I'm too legit and they're not. There you go. Every single time you get in the ring and get on a mic. You have no, have no respect. Oh, it's intermission. I will be right back, Tom. Please uh, monitor my chat and make sure that uh, people are following the rules. Uh, I just got—I got to go make a sandwich or something. I'm. I'm
I haven't eaten yeah, since well, this you hor- Yeah, you go make that, and then I'm going to go make my toast after you make your sandwich. Yeah, okay. I'll be right back. Sound. Oh, yeah, no problem, Sam. you got to be quick, though, Doobie. Can't keep it on the screen for too long, but there you go, mate. So, Ellie, how has your day been today? I don't hate you. I just hate your attitude. Your wrestling style. Uh, your egotisticalness. Your face. Fair enough. Oh, nice, Ellie. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. I'm glad you fixed that, man. I can't wait to watch the Scarface uh, short film, Ellie. Your point, Charlotte? And how do you know us now? You're not in the same room as I am. Send snacks. <laughs> I have snacks. That's some food. Thank you, KK. Ooh, that's good, Ellie. That's pretty good. That's pretty good, Landon. I'm not believe beneath your level, like at all. But uh, uh, Landon, do you know who won? Who's won more titles than AJ Styles? Vacant. Vacant is the greatest champion of all time. No cap. He currently the NXT Tag Team Champions. Oh, nice. Yeah. Fair enough, Ellie. Fair enough. Vacant's amazing. Ooh, Savage Ellie. Yeah, I know, I know. Okay, okay. Alright, um, Tom, I'm back. Definitely not the best in New Japan. and make your toast. Sam? No, it's Ellie. Alright, Dave's in charge for a sec. Hey, what's going on, Ellie? Um, I, I take it you're talking to Charlotte? Ellie? I mean, I, I can be pretty cringe too, not gonna lie. Yeah, you got it, Ian. We're a Leaf fan here. We're, we're not. Uh...
All right, honey, will do. Love you. I'm doing well, Resident Evil. How you doing, man? Oh, that's unfortunate, Charlotte, because we, we, uh, you know, I wouldn't say we're fond of you, but wouldn't say we hate you either. But you, you're you bringing hate to a place of, uh, of love and friendship. That's kind of sucks. <clears throat> And then you've got Ellie. Yeah, I know. But you know what? Sometimes it's nice to just be yourself instead of, you know, playing the character. Um, I, I think AJ Styles' best years are behind him. I need time to hurry up and get back. I know. But are you really a villain in real life or are you a decent human being? Because Charlotte Flair is literally a character that you play. You as a person are not Charlotte Flair. Hi, Ian. Uh, are you back, Tom? Uh, no, just uh, just stepping back while my toast is still toasting. Like I said, I can okay, hear all your conversation. Uh, gonna, I just want to see what Charlotte was chatting about. I gotta go, check, I gotta go about. check what I have on the stove. I'm boiling water for uh, like an Uncle Ben's uh, instant rice thing. You go and check that and... Uh, I will uh, go check my toast after you get back because mine is not going to fuck itself. Yeah, okay. One one last thing before I step away for another minute. Um, that's the char that that's the person we want. The the, the 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 I'm decent in IRL. That's who we want. And uh, no, I'm I don't follow Minnesota. Hello, Cyrus. I'm sorry I don't bow down. I only bow down to when I'm when I'm meeting people that require me to bow down. Which is not many people. Yeah, he's going to check it, and then I'll go get my toast. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that you lost some subscribers, Resident Evil. Don't burn the toast. I won't, KK. Don't worry. It's only on one minute, so it won't burn. I have to toast it twice because I don't like doing it on two minutes because then I end up burning it. So I just do it on like one minute, uh, flip it around, do it on another minute, and it's normally ready by then. Ah, fair enough. Tampa Bay fan and Las Vegas Golden Knights fan. Fair enough, man. Not too bad. Two pretty decent teams, I might. Ah, fair enough, Ian. We are Toronto Maple Leafs and uh, Seattle Kraken fans. <gasps> Not Gordon Ramsay. Pop tarts are lovely. Yes, they are. Uh, who, in my opinion, is the best Japanese wrestler ever? Probably Okada. It's fucking incredible. I won't burn the toast. That's your toast. I am going for toast. Tag. All right, Ian, you're allowed to cheer for who you want to cheer for, man. Uh, here, uh, here, most of us are Leafs fans, though, so. Oh, excuse me. Oh, no, it was just a pot of water on the stove. Uh, I don't think we're going to see Brock Lesnar for another little bit. It's planting season. I wouldn't say he sucks, but I would say his his what he's doing right now is getting a little bit stale. Uh, what? 
I don't do road work. I build fences, decks, and remove trees. Uh, currently, no. Maybe initially when I when I first started rewatching WWE, but uh, your your character is kind of stale too. I have returned to the stream. Okay, I have to go and stir rice. Okay. I'll be right back. Fair enough, Cyrus. Thank you, Ellie. Oh, well, Carter would definitely destroy. Hopefully one day, as an evil. You don't like Maple Leafs fans. Why? I mean, you kind of in a room full of them. Landon, KK, me, Dave. You're pretty much in a room full of Maple Leafs fans. Okay, Cyrus, fantastic, man. Wow. Josh is amazing. French toast isn't bad. Not bad at all. Yes, let's go. Nice, awesome, Jay. Uh, no, the next WrestleMania is 39, dude. No, I'm just eating normal toast. Cyrus said he liked French toast. Not going to happen, Landon. New Japan and AEW are going to have a show together because, well, New Japan now has AEW content on their streaming platform. That would be wicked, Landon, but not going to happen. New Japan's working with AEW. Why are you scared awesome, Jay? Oh, damn. Just stay inside and stay safe, awesome, Jay. You'll be fine, dude. Yeah, you'll be fine. No. Yeah, they did Resident Evil. Wasn't a bad match. You're not gonna die, awesome, Jay. Don't worry, man. You're safe inside. Fair enough, London. Well, 
What's up, Cyrus? Listen to Ellie. Ellie is wise. Her age has made her wise. Trying to find them. Whose wedding is tomorrow? You're wise, Ali. Nah, no, not a fan of peanut butter, mate. And we are about to be back for the second period. I'm back for now. I'm still going to have to be back and forth between the kitchen, but... Fantastic, Cyrus. Oh, we're just on your winner, Cyrus. That's fine, Ian. You don't have to hate the fans who like Maple Leafs, though. Just hate the team. That's fine, Ian. You're entitled to your fandom. Um, and we're, we're not typical Leaf fans either. We're, we're not... Uh... We're not overly obnoxious about it. I mean, me a little bit, but... You know, we're, we're not one of those... Uh, we're not those fans that are like, Oh no, the sky is falling! Because they lost two games at the beginning of the season. And her mom's Cyrus. And how will that Pepsi kill me, Johnny? People have been drinking Pepsi and Coke for literally over 200 years. Oh, about 160 years. Oh, uh, this is the last one. All right, I'll be right back. Yeah, you need a certain amount of sugar in your diet. And of Cyrus. <gasps> oh no, that was Landon. Landon. Well, stay where you are, Ian. You're not going to get second. Well, my, if we keep playing like we're playing today. Did not know that, Cyrus. No, it's not London. Get in there! Lilligren! Just gotta go! 1-1! One, one. Let's get in there, Leafs! Uh, not always awesome, Jay. Uh, most of the time they do, though. Oh, wait, I, I literally missed it going, going in, but I, I came in in time to see them score. So get in there, Leafs. Uh, no, a gimmick and a style are two different things. Uh, high flying, for example, like Rey Mysterio, is a style. Um, 
him being a luchador and the mask is more of a gimmick. Luchador actually is where high flying comes from in the first place, so luchador would be a style. Being masked or unmasked is kind of gimmicky, I agree. But typically in luchador history, if you're a luchador, you're a masked. You're masked. Oh, yeah. And a stars. Oh, good on you, little grin. Jeez. Uh, Nylander and Riley on the assist. Nice, nice. Good not, not point for uh, Nylander. And Riley getting a good point there, too. Thank you, Cyrus. <laughs> Come here, Ellie. Spam those Appreciate leaves some OGs. Because you can. Stream. Wait, what's uh, what's tomorrow? Wednesday. Yeah, tomorrow's Wednesday in AEW. Yeah, so um, no stream before AEW. I've got to go to a walk-in clinic tomorrow, and as soon as Jesse gets here, we're going. Um, oh, you can check out. You get your ear checked out. Uh, both of them, because like I, I, um. This is my I dinner, like Johnny. The this is the first the thing I've eaten game. all day. Everything's at like fifty hey, percent so? volume for me. I did see, yeah. Ah, oh, fair like, enough. I, I don't know if you've um, noticed, but I've asked you to repeat yourself like at least a dozen times today. And not to mention, I'm I'm starting to get like the the headaches are a little more continuous, and the, the, my ears actually hurt. So. Mm. But yeah, Johnny, this is literally my dinner, dude. I've not eaten all day. Well, I don't think... All I've eaten is... Uh, I've eaten four pieces of toast and a chocolate bar. Hey. Vegas is out yet. They're, they're still in. So, I mean, yeah, they're getting in on the wild card, but uh, Vegas is still in, so good on Vegas. Unlike our poor Kraken. Their season's done. They're playing for bragging rights Oh, London. Now. That's a nice sentence there, right? Yeah, man. yeah this is literally good. my dinner, Johnny. Yeah, by the way, um, these are up-to-date stats, just so you guys are aware. Yes, eh? It says the one that's saying pip pip cherry up. Oh, Sam, guess what happened last night? I got to play Mario Kart with the one and only Lord Freezer. You'll be seeing it on, probably on Monday, because uh, he's, he's going to be making it. He's going to upload it to his channel. Apparently he's going to be doing like playing with viewers on Mario Kart and stuff, and uh, obviously I'm a Twitch subscriber, so I get the privilege of playing with the Lord and Savior. Um, unfortunately he wasn't in a voice chat, which sucks because I would have loved to have had one-on-one -on -one chat with him. But he he's he's pretty good at Mario Kart. I'm shite. Um, wait, you have Mario uh, not, Kart Deluxe Eight? Yes. Remember, we were going to play it, and then the onlines were down. That one time we were going to play yeah, it. Yeah, we gotta we gotta figure out how to get uh, to get Ricky in on that too. Well, that'd be good. Um, he's got like three hundred thousand subscribers, I think. He's quite popular. Um, yeah, Seattle's definitely not making the playoffs. Three hundred thousand subscribers or three hundred thousand followers. Uh, let me check his subscriber count. Uh, where is he? Because um. 300,000 subscribers? Uh, He's making a mint. Um, YouTube subscribers, 333,000. He only has 75 Twitch subscribers. Still, that's fucking not bad. Uh, okay, now when you say Twitch subscribers, do you mean followers or do you mean No, I mean actual subscribers. How many actual. subscribers does he have? 75. Uh, and he has 2,400 uh, followers bad. on Twitch. Yeah, he's uh, not a bad. He's not. He's not a bad uh, little channel. Uh, I really enjoy him. Yeah, literally that was. He did the stream for nearly five hours. I joined in on like the last sixteen races because that's after my stream wrapped up. 
I think it's pretty good, Sam. I'm a well, you've all, of course you've already bought it, but of course you've already signed up to get a ticket. Um, Seattle's record. I'd have to pull up a web page for that. Give me a give me a minute. I'll let you know in just a second, Ian. And I am so used to uh, twenty-three, forty-three, six. Twenty-three wins, forty-three losses, and six overtime losses. Yeah, they're one of the worst teams in the NHL this year. We know. Uh, yeah, they're, I think they're they're uh, the only team that Coyotes, teams that are worse Canadians than are currently worse than them, so they are third worst team in the NHL. Hey, uh, no, Sam, I haven't actually. Uh, you know, you're not the worst in the league. All I can say is they can only go up from here. Fair enough, awesome, Jay. Oh, they're going to get a very good draft pick. Who they're going to go for will be the big question. And Johnny, like I said, this is literally my dinner, dude. Your point, mate? Am I not allowed to fucking eat? I have literally, I was literally at work, came home, had an hour to myself, and then literally came on camera. Yeah, Montreal's going to get another good one as yeah, well. Yeah, Montreal will uh, get a good draft pick. Coyotes will get a good draft pick. Coyotes, this race is going to get the best draft pick. Which are looking to maybe finish last. Apparently. The shorts are quite tied at this moment. 10 to Toronto, 9 to Buffalo. Um, didn't, you, didn't you know we're all unemployed fat robots that uh, don't need to eat, piss, drink, nothing? Fair enough. Welcome back, Ollie. Yeah. Nice, nice uh, defensive work there by Matthews. Well, attacking work. Sorry, I didn't realize what end they were in. Coyote's record is uh, 22-45-5. And Montreal is 20-42-11. and 11. Hey, uh, hey, Tom. Yeah. How, how can you tell that my wife isn't here? Um... I don't know. Besides the fact that I'm on cam by myself. I don't know. Um, oh, uh, no my means. Dinner was uh, uh was beans that I ate out of the straight out of the can and a uh, 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 basically instant rice. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, what did you do now, Mona? Prepping.
Oh, uh, oh, uh, yeah, that was quite obvious. Oh, uh, yeah, that that was poor there, Marna. That was poor. Yeah, they're all going to go. You realize we can still understand what you're saying, Carlito, right? Even though you're typing it all backwards. Maybe not as easily as, you know, as I'd read it forwards, but... Yeah, it says, Hello, Ellie, you should love me more than the other guys, just saying. The last word, well, other already got me for a second, trying to figure out what that one meant. But it took me a second and I got it. Yeah, and I still got to read it. Careful, it's off. Fuck's sake! Fuck off, Shogun. You should Shogun, have what the head. fuck was that, bro? Yes, you do know English. Ooh, you got pizza turtle. Like 63 points, something like that. Not very many. Yeah, they're 26, 37, and 11, the Buffalo Sabres. Nice tail. Oh, did I get it right? Holy fuck, I just took that off the top. I just took a guess. Because I thought I'd seen 63 points. I got it right. Decent. Um, the best out. What? The best way to, to get your points total, Ian, is if you already know their wins and their overtime losses, that's all you need to know. Multiply their wins by two. To get total points there, then add overtime losses. And you'll get their points total. Tom, if you could, please. 26 times 2 plus 11. Uh, that's 52 plus 11 equals 63. And leads are, what would that be? 94 plus 6 would equal 100. Yes, I did all that on the top of my head. I'm not that bad at basic maths. The Leafs do not have 94 points. You've got to add the 6 at the end, Ian. Uh, overtime losses equal 1 point each. Yep. Because you will always get a point for uh, an overtime loss. Oh, um, Uncle Ben's... Well, they're, they're just called Ben's now. Um, but it's... Um... A oh, broccoli cheddar flavored rice. Noise. Yeah, just like that, Ian. Uh, overtime losses are one point each. Yeah, yes, the Maple Loops have a hundred points. Galito. English only, and you know that. You, you've you spoken English in here before, too. You were speaking English as you five minutes ago. Uh, 
matter of fact, you speak English so well that you can type it in backwards. So no more Spanish. Exactly. I don't even know English that well, and I've spoken it and written it my entire life. Um, depends what they are and how dirty they get, how quickly, Bill. Uh, yeah, pants and depends, socks. It, de it depends on what the clothes are and what exactly I'm doing while I'm in them. Now, don't get me wrong, I wear the same pair of jeans over and over and over again because all I do is put them on, drive to work, take them off and don't put them on till the next day. So I don't wash them very often because they're literally worn for 15 minutes a day. It's a pair of jeans. Tom doesn't Whereas... stream with pants. You heard it here yep. first, guys. He just said it. He doesn't stream with no pants. I'm literally wearing pajama trousers, Dave. <laughs> and then, to be fair, I change like every week. Because again, I only wear them around the house. So, they're not worn in bed or anything. They're literally worn for the purpose of being on camera. Carlito, you're gay? Okay, fair enough. I'm not wearing any clothes, so... Nice, nice of you. Yes, Ian. You are correct. I am Flanders. This ski suit feels so loose. It feels so amazing. It feels like I'm wearing nothing at all. Nothing at all. Nothing, nothing at, all. at all. Stupid sexy Flanders. You know, for being in his 60s, Flanders is fucking jacked. I'll say. Like, it, Flanders is fit as fuck. And I mean, like, fit as in, like, he, he's got, like, really good physical fitness. Not as in, yeah. like, you know, like, Liv Morgan fit. Okay, Carlito. Shogun. Yeah, they are pronouncing it Shogun. You are correct, Dave. We are just going to start pronouncing it Shogun since they keep calling him that. I took my translation off Google. Oh, it told me to pronounce it. Oh, Kerfoot's pissed there. Uh, I have enough clothes to not have to do laundry for about nearly three weeks. I have enough clothes to last nearly three weeks without doing laundry. Okay, the same clothes all together um, that I lose after a day. Because I'm, I'm, I'm one of those guys, uh, I don't take a shower every time I shit. So, uh, yeah, um, I, I change my, my underwear every day. To be fair, Dave, who is a person who takes a shower every time they shit? Uh, apparently Bill McMahon. Fair enough. I've never heard that happen before. Um, I, I don't know. I, let, let's just put it this way. More often than... More more often than not, if my wife's doing like when we when we do laundry, the bulk majority of my laundry 
it, his socks and underwear because I change those every day. As long as there's I not a direct stain on my shirt, I'll, I'll wear or or my pants. I'll wear them for fucking a while. Uh, I change t-shirt, socks, and pants every day. Uh, trousers, but, 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 no. I mean, if you if you think about it, all I'm really doing is I'm I wake up, I get out of bed. I throw the clothes on, I walk over to my office, I park my ass down, I eat my breakfast, and then- Oh, oh what oh, the oh, fuck? How did oh, you not get that oh, in? Dad. Whistle it, Dad, Rev. Whistle it, Dad. It, Dad. Oh, fuck, that was close. But, uh, I eat my breakfast, and then I go live. Fair enough. Or I start working on beats, or I start working on the, the Pokemon game that I'm trying to, you know, trying to yeah. do. Uh, whereas I wear um, under, I wear my t-shirt under my chef jackets at work, so I have to change them every day because they've literally been at work for ten hours with me. Even when on my day off, uh, now, I now, get up. Here, here's the thing: is if I go to work and I work the day where I'm, I'm building fences and decks and I'm removing or removing trees, or you know, I go to work. Uh, I'm I'm coming home and I'm immediately changing my clothes and the clothes that yeah. I was wearing go in the wash and and you know I oh, know I don't I don't change until I go to bed well go for a shower before bed no, no, see the thing that you got to figure Tom I'm so some days when I when I'm you're building fences you're you're fucking shoulder deep in a fucking hole <laughs> right makes sense like we've got to, we got to, we got to dig holes that are four feet deep and if a, if you get a, a fucking rock at two and a half feet well guess what you're shoulder deep in that hole trying to get that fucking rock out of there mm. or you're digging makes another sense. hole beside, like you're, you're gonna you're gonna find out where that rock is so you can get it out you know like if i'm if i'm enough. laying all over the ground and rolling in the fucking dirt and you know, who build, working up a big sweat during the day because it's very physically demanding work. Uh, I'm changing my clothes when I come home because the first thing I want when I get home is a shower. Fair enough. Because it, it yeah, just, pre- when you're when you're doing physical labor like that, especially for you know eight, ten ten twelve hours some days, you you, yeah. you, you, you I don't know if for whatever reason it, it kind of feels like pent up rage by the end of the day. Like, you could just take yeah. somebody's fucking head off for no goddamn reason at all, other than the fact that you've been in the sun all day. So, you, um, but my, my first thing is I go in the shower and I just wash it away. Wash off the day. Yeah. Fair enough, Ellie. Um, I don't change my pajama trousers very often. I change them, like, once a week. Because I don't wear them in bed, I only wear them while I'm on street. Well... Basically, yeah, I lounge around the house in them. No chance of getting in the playoffs, uh, Ian. And yeah. by the way, Bill, I wasn't uh, I wasn't judging. If you wanna if you wanna take a, a shower every time you take a deuce, like that's up to you, man. Are there no other games going on right now, Tom? Uh, let me have a look. Cause uh, I'm wondering where RJ is with my sports, with my score updates. Maybe he's watching the basketball playoffs. RJ, come on, come on, wherever you are. Uh, yeah, currently we've got uh, Bruins versus Blues, Capitals versus Flyers, Maple Leafs versus Sabers, Predators versus Sharks, Rangers versus Hurricanes, Panthers versus Ducks. Samuelson oh. hurt, and Minnesota versus Oilers. There's quite a few games going on, uh, and unfortunately for us, the uh, Bruins are winning. Oh, he blocked Matthew's shot and took it in the ankle. Ooh. Wait, Spencer is playing, isn't it? Tripping penalty. Damn it. NHL, why did you lie to me saying that Spetsa was out? 
like fucking NHL. That's why that we we always put projected, right? Yeah, yeah. Because that way, if it is wrong, well, hey, your lineup's wrong. Well, it's projected. This is what people. This is what the news thought they were gonna go with. <laughs> yeah. Elias took a picture with Ezekiel. Yeah, because that picture is definitely not photoshopped. Wait, can I? Where where is that picture? Is that picture in our Discord? Uh, I can put it in the Discord. Uh, that'd be appreciated in the Discord. I'll share the link to the uh, Instagram post. Uh, put it in put it in wrestling where it belongs though. Fine. There you go. That should work. I need to get the stick off of those fucking rolls. Shit. I guess I'll be fucking RJ then for now. Currently we have the New York Rangers taking on the Carolina Hurricanes in the Tom, second Tom, period Tom, with Tom, one nil. You're RJ, you got to type it into my chat so I can read it and do the sports uh, fuck, updates. Fuck that, man. That's too much effort. <laughs> I knew that's what you'd say. <laughs> um, um, I, I hate to say it, but I need to be a little more active in the Discord, I think. If we're... Hey, Godly. Is, uh, Tom, Jesse's the same level as me. Ah, uh, okay. To be fair, Jesse does same. post memes a lot. Uh, hey, hey, do you get more experience for posting Godly? pictures and shit instead of just text? Uh, yeah, it gives, gives you the same. Oh no, the refs are, are really being kind of shit at the moment, dude. Oh, all those. Woo, hello, Catwoman, Liv Morgan. Yummy. Uh, so, so where where is it? I'm wrestling. I posted a uh, link to an Instagram post. Oh, okay. I, I was looking for the actual like picture of it. Yeah, I couldn't get the actual picture. You know, if that is photoshopped, that's a damn good photoshop. You have got to think WWE pay people millions to make pictures for WWE, so they best be fucking good at their job. Shogun made a good save, finally. Your record is okay. I love I love how people are like tag teams champions seems legit. Uh, I think I took this picture. I was there that day. <laughs> Elias walked what? so that Ezekiel could run. What is this gimmick though? I'm gonna pretend that I'm a different person. Okay. Oh man, that that that's just I don't know. Like that's a good Photoshop though. Yeah, it is. Um, how come you're posting all the all the records in the in the chat, Ian? Like this is uh, he, he, this is generally common knowledge to us.
not to be sorry. I'm just curious as to how come you're throwing that into the chat. Um, in wrestling games, I was always a, a big fan of the uh, the in here comes the pain. It was always uh, the pipe, or I liked the just running people over with the motorcycle. That was good. Thoughtlift was also a good weapon, but I think they'll shut your mouth. What's going on, Godly John? Because they're a playoff contention team going against a team that's not in playoff contention, and uh, therefore, and they have a lot of talent. Therefore, the refs are going to be way more stringent and biased towards the Leafs as a as a means to help Buffalo build confidence um, going into next season. You know, hey, we finished last season on a high note. You know, maybe we can get a good start to this season. Yeah, but then if you look at if you look at his line mate Mitch Marner, he's got loads of penalties drawn. It balances out there as far as I'm concerned. Yeah, baseball bad. I kind of agree with you there. Thank you, Ian. One of the disadvantages to being a star, if you can already go through that and score 60 goals in a season, you don't need the help of the penalty. I know it should be called anyways, but like you get what I'm saying, I hope. Yeah, and, and here's here's the other thing that I, I'm going to say, John, is how can you guarantee that a referee, despite not necessarily being from, we'll say Buffalo, because they're playing Buffalo tonight, right? Despite not being from Buffalo, how do you know that they are not a Buffalo Sabres fan? Right? How do you yep. keep the refs non-biased you really can uh, that happened in the World Cup um, we were facing Germany and the referee was from I think Portugal and we just knocked them out of the tournament the uh, game before so the referee was biased towards Germany because we'd knocked his country out of the World Cup it's like, why did you give us a referee from the country that we had just eliminated from the tournament? Like, the worst referee you could pick. And yes, we Second lost. Second intermission. Leafs are down 2-1 to one over Buffalo. Or with Buffalo. Ah, Rangers have made the playoffs. I believe isn't this the Rangers, like, one of the first times Rangers has made it in the playoffs. Um, but someone's saying they don't have much playoff Google, experience. I'll, I'll, I'll answer that question in just a second. How many times have the New York Rangers made it to the playoffs? Okay, they're they're an original six, just for the record, Tom. So they have made they have qualified for the playoffs so, uh, sixty times. Um, and, and they have uh, in 94 c uh, completed seasons oh in 94 completed seasons so they've been around for 94 seasons uh, excluding the lockout cancelled 04-05 uh, season this team has won four Stanley Cup championships and has qualified for the playoffs 60 times 
So 34 Fair times enough. they didn't make the playoffs in their entire history. Fair enough. I had to reread um, that. It, it, trust me, Godly. We have we have a system in football that checks uh, if goals are valid and all this bullshit, and it is fucking shite. It is absolutely fucking terrible. Trust me, you want manual people doing it because the AI system is shit. It doesn't work for the football, and it's not going to work for hockey. Computers are not smart enough to do it. I'm sorry, but they're not. It is something that a person has to assess. No matter how good computers can be, a person's intuition will always outbeat a computer. In those tasks. Uh, I don't think... Tom, if I'm gonna, if I'm honest, if I'm gonna stream me uh, creating this Pokemon game, like any of it at all, um, I, I think I'm only gonna. Ooh, pardon me, I'm only gonna stream bits and pieces of it. Fair enough. And maybe, maybe once I get a little bit better, you know, show me programming some of the, you know, the 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 later. Areas. Okay. Uh, we're down two to one. What's up? Uh, let's keep the fucking heat in. Um, couldn't be. I didn't turn it on. Did I not quite turn the burner off? Bloody old day. Oh, shit. Uh, Dave, 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 Dave. Who are you making the rival? What? In the book, among games. I haven't decided game. on names or anything like that. I haven't even figured out how to... Um, it's not set up to uh, to nickname the rival either. So, <laughs> so uh, like I, I, I don't know how how we're doing this. No, no, most godly, most of the um, uh, AR stuff is towards the goal, so it only covers a very small field. It's like it, it's it's shit. It wouldn't work. It just doesn't work. Yeah, and self-driving cars were killing people and crashing constantly. And still aren't that oh, great that's now. that's Tesla. True. That is true. Tesla's a shit. Eventually, a yeah. Shit right now. But the thing the, is, as soon as you, we start you know, making... You know the, the, the major difference between Tesla and fucking, like, and most other tr cars that they're trying to self-drive now? Um, a badge? Thank you very much, McDonald's. Um, no, they got way more cameras and way more blind spots, so the the car can actually see more. Mm, fair enough. Where you know most car, most other car models, they've got cameras in the mirrors, so that way you can see from side to side. But like, it has a lot of blind spot, blind spots too. Oh, well, that, that's unfortunate because I, I tend to talk a lot, you know, being the the, the broadcaster. Mm. Welcome back, Ollie. Yeah. Um, it's not a skirt, it's a kilt, you sicko. Yeah, kilt and a skirt are two different things. Uh, 
kind of for you. Hi, Bill. Yeah, still enjoying my dinner, Johnny. Uh, he's broadcasting to the internet. Um, like, for example, my software is literally know, called Xplit Broadcaster. On YouTube, which makes me a YouTuber and a broadcaster at the same time. His live streams are broadcasted where, you know, videos are just uploaded. Same with the news. His news broadcast, this is a YouTube broadcast. Broadcast means something that's being aired. Um, I, I disagree, Bill. It's a good match I type, but... They get kind of boring after a while because it's all, all the heels attack the face, the face attack the heels. Uh, I, um, I, I can get behind those. Uh, that's my good friend and colleague uh, Tom from All Things Wrestling. His link is in the description below. And speaking of Tom from All Things Wrestling, thank you to him and A, it's Kev, also known as Turtle, uh, for being Tier 2 or better members. Oh, pardon me. Thank you guys very much for your generosity, as well as the generosity of our uh, our other members as well. Hey, there's RJ. What's going on, man? Carolina Hurricanes uh, hey, won all at the end of two against the New York Rangers. Thank you very much. We appreciate the like, McDonald's. I definitely uh, needed something to eat. The role of a broadcaster, your role is to entertain and inform an audience by presenting informational entertainment in an accessible or attractive way. You'll introduce coast uh, introduce host or co-host uh, a program, create links between items, introduce and interview guests, and interact with an audience. Well, so, we definitely yeah. do the bulk majority of that on a day-to-day -day basis. Now we do. Holy shit, the Ducks are beating the Panthers! Don't that is not some personal comment. Oh, your Panthers don't care though, do they? I agree, Johnny Blaze. There's there's no competition, man. The the Whopper's like two times the size of a Big Mac. Hi, McDonald's. Chips. Yes, get in there, St. Louis. Tie it up, thank God. <laughs> Holy shit, Capitals are spanking Philadelphia. Yeah, your point, McDonald's. Your point. All right, Bill, take it easy, man. <laughs> um, I got to catch up on the sports updates. Anaheim Ducks are up on the Florida Panthers 2-1 to one after 2. St. Louis Blues are tied with Boston at 2 with 3 minutes left in the second period. And the, the Philadelphia Flyers are getting absolutely trounced tonight by the Washington Capitals. It is 5-1 after 2. Um, also, we've got the Pittsburgh Penguins playing the New York Islanders tonight. No, but I wonder about Donald. Islanders are up 3-2 with just about half the game left to go. Uh, 11 minutes left in the second period of that game.
Actually, veggie straws are uh, are pretty decent too. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, but I don't want to eat them. I'll sit here and eat my chips. Yeah, so, so Tom, you remember the other night, uh, or the other day, on stream, like, not on necessarily entirely on stream, but I had, like, four cups of coffee and a monster that day? Yeah, I remember that. Do you know what time I got up that day? Um, 2.30. Uh, it, was a, it was a lot earlier than that. That particular day, we were up early. We were up at, like, 9.30, 10 o'clock. Do you know what time I went to bed because of all the caffeine in me? That, like, I, that was finally when I felt tired. Six. 5.30. <laughs> we finally went and laid down. Do I work out? No, I don't have time. Um, all right. Ottawa but Senators I do a physically all, um, running around job. Against the Detroit uh, Red Wings with 11 and a half minutes left in the second period. San Jose Sharks and the I National run around Predators the kitchen for ten to twelve hours a day. At the end of the first, my job and is involving me running around like an idiot for ten to twelve hours a day. One nothing at the end of one. Thank you again, uh, RJ, very much for the uh, the score I mean, updates for the NHL games. With a name like Rebecca McDonald's, girl a couple how of weeks healthy ago. can you be, my dude? Actually, a workout can be anything. Going for a walk is considered a workout. Uh, and I do my fair work, share of yeah. a lot of walking in a day. Oh, that sucks. What? I have to go. I have to go and do my walk tonight. Not only without Jesse, but I have to do it like basically in silence. I don't think I'm gonna go tonight. Fair enough. Oh, those that that sounds nice. Send on Johnny. <laughs> I'll take some. Los Angeles Kings versus the Chicago Blackhawks. Uh, nothing, nothing in about the middle of the first <clears> year. <throat> McDonald, you're an asshole. There you go. That's decisive enough for you. And you want to know the funny thing, Tom? Well, he's he's picking on you, and I probably weigh more than you. Dude, you weigh way more than me. On a on you a tell me how much you weigh, and I can tell you how much I weigh. You you, you weighed like at least eighty pounds more than I do. Mm-hmm. But you know what, Dave? Taking a walk tonight actually sounds like a good idea. I might go do that. I might go take like a ten minute walk. Uh. Actually does not sound like a like, bad idea. I've been meaning to try and get back into walking a little bit after, before going to bed, so I might do that.
yeah, I walk a lot at my job that I'm there for 11 to 12 hours a day where I don't get to sit down and I'm constantly walking and doing shit. The opinion was not requested in that, my Donalds. Fair enough, Ellie. I don't think mine will be classic 80s music, but it'll be, it will be my uh, current playlist that uh, is songs I'm enjoying at the moment. So, just blast that on. Have a little bit of walk. Literally to the beginning of my state and back, which is, I don't actually know how far that is. I don't think I've ever walked so it shouldn't be too long, take like 10 minutes or so to do that. Yeah. I do cook. No, I'm not the head chef. I'm a line chef, so I'm under the head chef. It's my job to prepare the food, cook the food and send the food. As well as prep the food. And do whatever else is needed. It does, Elliot. I do love the dark, though. I am a big fan of the dark. How do you know that? Y you have... Absolutely zero evidence to back up that statement. Dave, I'm a better unicycle rider than you. Most likely. Uh, well, it, it we got no evidence to prove to, otherwise. It, it really took a lot for me to learn how to ride a two-wheeled bike. I don't even want to try and learn how to ride a one-wheeled bike. Yeah, neither do I, to be fair, dude. <laughs> Major League Baseball, Toronto Blue Jays are losing 3-0 no, no, to the New York Yankees at the top of the fifth. Uh, let's go, Blue Jays. Okay, okay. Blue Jays, Blue Jays. Let's, let's play baseball. Yeah. You know they uh, they they still play that song to this day at this, when you're there as part of the seventh inning stretch. I did not. That's wicked. Yeah, and I, I don't know if they do this in other stadiums, know, but uh, at the at the sky, I call it the Sky Dome. It was the Sky Dome for forever. I hate the fact that they changed it to Rogers Center, but uh, I'm calling it the Sky Dome. But uh, they uh, they have a seventh inning stretch where they where they actually like in the it's, I think it's either at the very beginning or the or somewhere in the middle like while they're changing the teams and they they get up they get people stretching and dancing around grooving to a to a song about Blue Jays and playing baseball. Nice. Um, first off, and being then, a head chef doesn't course, automatically I'm make you better than me. Man, I've worked with my, fa I've worked with enough fair share of chefs to know that just because you're a head chef doesn't mean you're competent. And second of all, uh, congratulations, you work 15 hours. Watch that still doesn't mean you're better than me. Not the the... chefs can be fucking dumbasses. You, you, and, nothing and there is proven that you are better than me. So but, your period uh, end of story is bullshit because so far nothing there has proven that you you could cook better than me. Uh, I've worked with enough incompetent fucking well. head chefs to know. But there's literally like a Blue Jays song. Fair enough, Johnny. McDonald's name should be MJF. I'm better than you, and you know it. That that's you, McDonald's. But again, no, I, I can cook pretty much anything. What have you cooked? Also, congratulations, you do more hours than me. That kind of makes you an idiot, to be honest.
taxation works in uh, in England. But uh, here, if you work more, you make more, and you're more likely to get taxed more. Oh, yeah. So it's they also, making... after, uh, working more than 13 hours in this country is technically illegal. The max you're allowed to do in a day is, I think, 13 hours, and then it's considered illegal. Yeah, they really our, our government's really kind of kibosh doing double shifts, eh? Yeah. No, don't get me wrong. I've done more than thirteen hours in a day. Bet you that's a but... miserable fucking day. Oh no, it was a fucking sad. I enjoyed that day. I just fucking. Oh, yeah? It was a pretty sound day, actually. To be fair. See, I'd I'd be okay like if the if the team switched out about set halfway like for a 13 14 hour shift or anything double like the the the, the whole team's got to swap out at some point yeah they do they just get kind of long well that's what i'm saying and i'm not doing the same thing all fucking day either Like, like I'd literally turn to the boss and say, "I'm doing, I'm going, I, I, I've done this for like ten hours. I'm going to do the last three hours on pot wash." <laughs> like I don't even give a shit. I'm doing dishes. Like, <laughs> like fuck off. I, I, I just, I, I wouldn't so be basic, able to do it. Basic food then, uh, McDonald's. Basic food then. Um, meatloaf is basically a giant meatball. So not impressed. Brownies, sausage, burgers, chicken. Okay, so chicken stir fries, kind of depending on what you put in it, could be. God fuck. damn it! Uh, poached. All chicken of us basic just... foods. Wait, poached chicken isn't that just boiled chicken? <laughs> Pretty fucking much. <laughs> Duchess potatoes. What the fuck are Duchess potatoes? How the much chicken at Google? I'm not sure off the top of my head. Might be something we don't have over here. Uh, pizza's not difficult, and my wife makes pizza <laughs> like... time, so. Uh, Ellie is the moderator, so you'll show them respect, or they will time you out. Um, it is a... Uh... Oh, it's basically a swirled version of mashed potatoes with some cream and egg in it. It's... Basically, fancy oh. mashed potatoes. Oh, uh, okay. Fair enough. It's fancy mashed potatoes. Well, you just you just told Ellie to shut it. That, that's not showing Ellie respect. Have you ever made souffles? I've made souffles. I had to make fucking like two hundred fucking souffles. Don't you set souffle on fire at some point? Uh, yeah. Uh, no, that's creme brulee. I think you're thinking of. Okay, because I know I know there's some sort of like something or another that at some point you like you don't keep it on fire for very long, but you set it yeah, on that, fire. That, and... That's creme brulee, and yes, I've made creme brulee as well. Um, that, uh, that he's not a complete good. asshole, so he's just saying nobody cares. What is a baked, what, what is a baked Alaska? Uh, it's like... When, when, I, when yeah. I think of Alaska, I think of, like, rugged wilderness and, you know, the ocean. It's a very... Right it's there. dessert. Um... Oh, it looks wicked. Uh, what the it's ice it? cream surrounded by meringue and sponge cake. And the meringue is often lemon, isn't it? Uh, basically, because of uh, the outside, the ice cream in the mi in the middle don't melt when you cook it in the oven, which is pretty cool. Uh, just stop what? Fair enough, Johnny. I do have McDonald's in my chat. That's well, it. We're done. Another one for Buffalo. We're well, done. That's it. Paul Schulgren. Let's go. Get the fucker off there.
Jesus Christ. Two goals in like fucking a minute and a minute. Yeah, I definitely think we should be putting the crying emoji. I think this game is done. Yeah, I think that's what I owe your chat. And I think I owe uh, that to mine. Oh, nice, no, awesome, Jay. Maybe he will, but his home is definitely not to be defeated. He, he can sign to any company he wants. He just doesn't want to. Whoa, that took a dark turn, London. It really isn't. WWE treated him like crap. Yeah, WWE buried the best thing they had going for them in the Twice. Field. They buried the best thing they had twice. I didn't. I, I can't admit to watching it, but uh, there, there was a, a from Wrestling Network. Um, a, his one of his videos said that uh, the title said that he was potentially being difficult before he was released. Hmm. They're really not the best uh, company in this era. I will shit on WWE all I feel like. Because you know what? I have a brain and a mouth and I can. Yeah, they're really not, dude. They're really not. And uh, New Japan's they're, they're better a shit than company. The, uh, I, I don't know about that one. I'm not a bit. I'm not. I don't know. I, I just find uh, New Japan very stiff. Yeah, but at least they didn't fire like 200 of their people over a fucking global pandemic and then fucking while they were making record fucking profits. I will say that AEW is definitely better than... Uh... And that's not a bad thing, McDonald's. That's not a bad thing. At least they fucking do some quality content. I, I no, will, I'm going to be McIntyre and I'm going to threaten the same there. people with a sword for the 15th time in a week. Um, I, I will agree with McDonald's there. AEW is... They're, they're overdoing it with the blood, man. Like, I was happy to see it for the first little bit. But, like, now they're just over uh, Yeah, that's they're, really they're not a statement it. to be correct, is it, McDonald's? Uh... The current world champion and tag team champions are not ex WWE guys. Neither is your women's champion. So yeah, where's your WWE guys there? But there's also a lot of like a lot of talent that I yeah, and a lot of WWE talent are ex Ring of Honor stars. Like, most of the Charlie talent making up Ricochet. WWE are ex-Ring of Honor stars. So, your point literally becomes mute. When some of the biggest okay. people in the entire yeah. WWE Some, uh, were all picked from, from different companies. Well. So, your point becomes completely mute at that point. Fair enough, Carlito. Oh, this is a painful game to watch. Fair enough, Awesome Joe. How, Landon?
Sorry about that, folks. Uh, go on with what you haven't said anything. <laughs> the last thing you said is all XW debris, guys, and that's blatantly not fucking true. Uh, MJF never been in WWE. Wardlow never been in WWE. Uh, let's see the Young Bucks briefly maybe in the developmental stage hangman briefly in the developmental stage mjf was there for about three weeks mjf is 100 percent on x wwe guy hey we got one that's gonna get reviewed Hmm. And surprisingly, where were all of those ex WWE guys before they went to WWE? Ring of Honor. And, and Seth Rollins. Too, Ring of Honor. AJ Styles. TNA in New Japan. And to be fair, CM Punk yeah, left wrestling good. seven years ago. Tom, we got one back. It's good. That definitely good, rolled good. over the line. Yeah. yeah Seth Ro oh, Kevin Owens. Ring of Honor. Ricochet. That's... Ring of Honor. Yeah. No, but your statement's not true. You've named like six people. And CM, P CM Punk has less wrestling for seven years. So your point is completely mute there. And MJF was in... WWE for nothing. He was there and they never signed him a contract. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, well, Cody Rhodes is ex AEW, so. <laughs> and if you want to go back further, um, Hulk Hogan, ex Territories, Steve Austin, ex WCW, Eddie Guerrero, ex WCW, Chris Benoit, ex WCW, Undertaker, ex ex NWA. Um, you've, I have done research. Oh, Sting X and, yeah, Sting was in WWE and had four matches. Doesn't make him X WWE. He was far bigger name than WWE. Uh, 2-1 yeah. for the Hurricanes over the Rangers in the third period. Ooh, nice. Oh, so, you're laughing at what, dude? Because your points get completely moot. You name like seven people. The current world champion and most of the champions aren't from WWE. I mean, Eva Marie. What is even that sentence? Uh, yeah, you can't just end the conversation because you want to end the conversation. That's not how it works. You can't end the story because you're losing. Am I the only? I can't be the only one who thinks this, but uh, I think that uh, the entire wrestling industry would be much better off if they had a more open talent exchange. That would be amazing. How am I and Eva Marie want to be? You're now becoming insulting because you've lost. You're getting really defensive and just trying to throw insults at me because you've clearly lost. Yeah, from my point of view, he's not wrong. Me or him? You're not wrong, Tom. Oh. Thank you. Then why are you just trying to insult me, dude? The, the, you start insulting someone in an argument when you lose. Hey, hey, That's Tom, like... You, you, you yeah. know what you looking like Eva Marie maybe means to, to him? Well. Is you. Wow, so beautiful. <laughs> Thank you, Awesome Jay. Oh, 
Oh, fucking hell, Capitals are up by you, another you two. Jesus Christ. Us, so. Fucking hell, seriously? That went in, didn't it? No. Maybe? Pucks in, it pucks in the back of the it net. definitely went in the net. Penguins are tied 3-3 with the New York Rangers at the end of two. Uh, Philadelphia... Uh, yeah, see, McDonald's, this is the thing. You're now getting defensive and just throwing insults at me that you've already lost. Congratulations. Yeah. Because you don't start insulting uh, somebody. Tom, 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 it's time to focus on something else. And, yep, there you go. We got five minutes. Washington what? Capitals over the Philadelphia Flyers. Seven to one. I didn't say. Capitals are doing great. Third. They're having a real good game tonight. Oh, thank you, Austin J. Either that or Philadelphia's goalies are having a real bad night. Might be a Are Capitals in contention for playoffs? I think the Capitals need this win. Uh, where are we? Table. Uh, yes, they are fourth uh, yeah, in they, Metropolitan. Uh, awesome, awesome. Uh, Tom, I, I don't know what happened. He was, he was really nice in my chat. Of course you did. The game didn't work. Yeah, good. Mara should be fucking fined. Oh, we're going to make sure you're locked down for Christmas, but we're going to have a fucking party. Jackass. Fucking hypocritical uh, MP. He can't undo the... He, he, do, you, do you accept the apology, Tom? I guess, yeah. Uh, unfortunately, even though he accepts your apology, he, he can't undo the timeout you in his chat. So you're you're kind of yeah, you're kind of timed out there. Wait, What's going now on, did that go in? Are we counting it because it still says? I, I don't know. I just came back from commercial apparently. Well, well it didn't go in. in on him? We don't want to see him. I want to see if that. Okay, went well in. it's under there. Uh... Okay, whistle went, so I think it didn't count. I heard a whistle before it went in, went into the net, so no, that didn't go in. Alright. Yeah, fuck Boris Johnson. Would have been nice if we'd got that goal. Lilligren. Damn, Lilligren. Good effort, man. Matthews, how did you let that go straight through your legs? Damn, man. You've let a perfect Lilligren opportunity go there. like a boss tonight. It really is. What? What about Kevin Owens? <clears throat> yeah, what about Kevin Owens, McDonald's? Oh, but you know what I need you to do, Dave? I need to empty all my goddamn bins because it's bin day tomorrow. And I best put it out because I'm pretty sure my black bin is full. Um... It is Tuesday, yes. Yeah, sh I, I gotta bring shit out tonight, too. <laughs> Good. Glad I could remind you. I haven't put my black bin out in, like, four, like, in the last two times, I think. Maybe, no, I missed last time, because I'm lazy. But I I'm gonna take that little walk and drop the bin out, I think. Fair enough, uh, Johnny. What's going on, Tim Hortons? 
Yeah, and they made no account, Dave. Why? I don't know, maybe not. Oh, no wonder Hulk sucks. He's wearing number three. Why, is that like a cursed number? Huh? Uh, oh, no, three just, like a uh, the, last person, uh, the last person that I can recall wearing number three for the Leafs was uh, Dion Phaneuf, and when we when we got him, he was well past his prime, and he was he was just, in my opinion, slow as fuck. He put multiple goals in, uh, in his own net over the course of a season. Oh. That is not good. Yes, get in there, uh, St. Louis. What about Canada? I'm from Canada, so uh, yeah. Good job, St. Louis. Yeah, what about Canada? Oh, okay. All right. That's funny. Fern of Hortons. What, Lennon? Wow. Ottawa Senators are up on the Detroit Red Wings one two to one at the end of two. Landon, are you Tim of the Hortons account? Why? What, what does that even mean? Okay. It makes my no, blood flow. Awesome, okay. Should I be getting offended here? Um, I don't know, but, uh, I'm watching them very closely. Halfway through the first period, the Sharks and the Preds are tied at zero. This is, this should be a good win for Nashville, considering how low the, on the totem pole the San Jose Sharks are. Come on, Nashville, pull something out. Okay, so you, you despise the country in, in, in which I come from. Yep. Bye. Didn't think I had to do that one. No, no. I was waiting for them to say that. Right. Hey, Kev. <laughs> I, I knew it was only a matter of time before they said something. To the, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I was just waiting for them to clarify the point. Oh, okay. Halfway through the second period, it's still nothing, nothing between Nashville and San Jose. That's how uh, I thought it was way when he said first. Uh, I swear that game started ages ago. Welcome back, Carlito. <laughs> it's, it, 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 it's okay. It's okay. It happens. No, no, it doesn't, Dave. That just doesn't just happen. Right. Wow, Minnesota's giving it to Edmonton tonight too. Three yeah. two, three nothing after uh, after half the game's done. Just under ten minutes left in the second period.
Kings are beating Blackhawks. I need to go and buy bin bags. That's what I need to do. And that's an instant ban. Now, thank you, Ellie. Both me and you got that one. Kind of dumbass. Special kind of dumbass. One hope, one dream. So I was trying to rewrite uh, It's a Kind of Magic. Oh, Jesus I can't Christ. That was needed. Oh. Oh, I'm glad to hear that, awesome Jay. You know what I think I'm going to do tonight, Tom, after this? Uh, don't know what. I think I'm going to work on my Pokemon game for a little bit. Do you? No, I took a piss. Because uh, I think by the end of tonight, I want to have the entrances and exits for uh, for the Pokemon lab. Um, I want to have uh, the rival's house set up. I want to have the uh... Uh, I want to get a few things done tonight if I can. Yeah. But don't forget to take your recycling out or black bin, whichever one it is. Yeah. You don't. Yeah, you do. Don't worry about it, Kath. They're gone. Game over. That's it. We're done. Yep, that's it. Uh, Philadelphia. Oof, uh, Washington able to add another tally. They're up eight to one now. Uh, St. Louis <laughs> is uh, up over Boston four two with ten or with nine and a half minutes left in the third, and the Leafs are down five uh, two. What, what Ellie said, London. Minutes left. What Ellie the said. They're done. Yeah, they never actually said the word. Oh, St. Louis is now up to. They knew they were going to get banned, so they just decided to do something to get banned for the twats. Uh, Leafs. Um, that or we just. Mm, probably, Adam. We really need to fucking sort out gold ending. We really do. Guys, do you think we should start playing Life is Strange tomorrow? Because I should be home by about half eight. Quarter, um, uh, half eight, nine o'clock. I question and people said play 2K. Uh, no, that's Friday. 
Yeah, that's happening Friday in the afternoon. Uh, this is for tomorrow evening. Uh, when before, do you want to uh, play Life is Strange? Uh, tomorrow evening before AEW. I get home at 4 p.m. Well, earlier than 4 p.m. your time. So it gives me. I've got like three hours of spare time before AEW. So I might just try and get a bit of Life is Strange smashed out. I don't know Resident Evil. Hopefully soon. I think Manitoba's the next province over. If not, I, I forget what order it goes. It goes Ontario. Is it Ontario, Alberta, Manitoba? Or is it Ontario, Manitoba, Alberta? I, I gotta look up. It's been too long since I've had a look at the actual like map of Canada, so. Uh, give me, give me, uh. Give me a minute here. Oh, he's making his NHL debut today, not just his um, Sabres debut. Well, that's that's what I said. Uh, I can't remember what you said. I didn't know if you said Sabres debut or NHL debut. Um, map of yes, Canada. Blame Canada. Blame Canada. Please sing the rest um, of the I'm song. I'm the next day. province over of Manitoba. Um, it, I, I'm in uh, the the southern part of Ontario, and uh, it goes Ontario, I'm Manitoba, it, yeah. Saskatchewan, Alberta, British Columbia. So, <sighs> um, I'm sort of close to Manitoba in the sense that you know, like, you know, <laughs> Canada's close to the United States. Well, Kev, you're not really doing your job, man. Is uh, no, I, I not not once did I see you spam the Leafs logo. Uh, you you definitely aren't. Didn't spam F's in okay. chat when the game was was you know lost to us. Twice, lost to us twice. 20 seconds left in the game, the Leafs get a fucking power play. Yeah, we've done ours. Feel free, Landon. I mean, if, when you become channel member, you can, you know. That's we're done. Uh, um, that would be uh, that would be this one. F's in chat. F's in chat, guys. That's bullet holes for the Leafs, because they were poor as this fuck and let in way too many goals. Yeah. Oh, the bullet holes. I made a middle finger out of bullet holes, Tom. Look at that. No, I made a ring finger out of bullet holes. Damn it. Yes. Molson, three stars. We got uh, Craig Anderson, the goalie for the Buffalo Sabres, who made 23 saves, coming in as the third star. Oh, excuse me. The number two star, uh, Mr. Morgan Riley, good, strong defensive man for the Leafs, getting two assists tonight. So he was in on both goals for the Leafs this evening. And uh, Taj Thompson, Taj Thompson, uh, number one star with his 33rd goal this season. But, uh, all right. Uh, I think.
think it's your turn, Tom. Fair enough. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Pretty sure it's your turn. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, closing that so I can hear. Uh, definitely not random. But we are going to wrap this up now. Uh, this has been, um, well, a hockey game. I'm going to take this off. As a sadness, but I lost. You get to see my Wicked Avengers t shirt that I'm wearing. Uh, but yes, uh, good night, Ellie. Good night, Landon. Good night, Carlito. Good night, Johnny. You're not wrong there, Johnny. At least never get out for sheer teams. No, you're not, Kev, because it's not. It's a bullet hole. Uh, no, because there's definitely, that is definitely not a, no. No, no. Kev. Uh, but yes, thank you all for watching. We shall be back tomorrow. Um, something sticking if I can... out of it that is clearly punctured in. Yeah. Uh, we shall probably play a bit of Life is Strange True Colors tomorrow. Because uh, I get to finish work at, like an hour and a half early. So it gives me enough time to actually get home and do a stream before AEW. So we'll try and get a bit of gaming in there if we can. Uh, and then, yeah, we'll watch AEW, which is apparently going to be a bit longer than two hours. So, looking forward to it. Uh, but thank you for watching. Make sure you smash the like button. Um, obviously, subscribe. And we shall catch you all tomorrow. Bye. Peace out. And I am out.